All right, so I actually find this a unique type of uh, gas station. Hey, so why is it called, um, so like, this is like basically the county town of uh, gas stations pretty much? Uh, yes, sir. Okay, cool. Yes, sir. Uh, 20 on so over here, Thank you very much. Good night. we have these knives. You got some free maps in North Carolina. Yeah, it's like unique because like I was looking outside. They have a uh, they have that thing of the horse and like the Karen's Kitchen and everything. And yes. it's like uh, seventy six was the first gas station uh -huh. to start uh, to, to be trucker friendly. And oh. As you, know, as you know, if you drive anywhere, seventy six is dying out. So Karen, who is the owner, you know, she uh, she bought the place. She's had it for like five or six years, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, she's trying to blow it up. She's trying to expand it. She's trying to give truckers room to park. They have a, a truck stop down here. It's always full. They ask to park here. They can, but the space here is limited. So she just bought all this land around here to become trucker friendly again. We have truckers stopping here all the time. Wow. Uh, they're like, man, I saw it was 76. We're stopping to see if y'all was bringing the truckers place back to life. And I'm like, we are. We're trying, you know. Takes a little bit of that, you know. Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah definitely. But totally. She has done a lot here, and she has a she has has a hired professional in here right now. You know, not to, like literally tonight. You know, that's trying to reorchestrate everything, make it more customer friendly to expand. You know, we got a lot of room out back that's already waterized, electrified, all that. If we go this way, she's gonna make a drive around. Wow. Stuff, you know. It's pretty cool. Oh yeah. I've become educated on seventy six since working here. You know. Hey. Yeah. Any good, any kind of education yeah. is good, man. Yeah, oh, I know that. Yeah, it most definitely is. Most definitely is. Yeah. yeah, I always like learning things. That's like what I do with my channel. I learn a lot. Yeah. I hear. It. Yeah, I, I, the guy was like, "Hey, man," he said, "I come in here to investigate, see what kind of stuff you got going on." And he's the one who educated me and told me that 76 was the first trucker-friendly gas station. Yeah. You know? And they are dying out now. 76 is dying out. You know. Oh yeah. So over there is. Uh, where all the uh, things are with the welcome, which is uh, <laughs> so this is called, yeah, so 76, that's why they built this gas station. Four. I like this. Uh, I like these, like, like types of, uh, uh, cups and glasses and furniture and stuff. The funny thing about, uh, the glass things, I had for, um, me and my cousin had a fight one time with, uh, and we broke the glass doll from the microphone model. And we went and bought a new one for her, but <laughs> it got pretty, pretty uh, stupid for it. This is cool, though. This is like a unique gas station. And here, I'm not gonna go in it, but you can see this is like the beer section. They actually have, well, like they have a lot of places that have these beer caves down here because you could do that in North Carolina in the <laughs> South. You can't do that in Pennsylvania. But, so like this part is regular gas station. You know, your ordinary stuff. But what's really cool is, I'm not going to show them right there, but, well, this way. Now, this is a really unique gas station. The country settings, it's so cool. But this is what's really cool. It's called, oh, they have an ice cream shop right here. And this is Karen's Kitchen. Oh, I didn't know how big it was. Like the further I go back, I go back all the way over here.
Oh, wow. So this is unique with the um, different things of 76 and racing. This is really cool. Hard charging IRL driver. Relish's brush. Ooh. We have a good trophy there. Oh, nice. Yeah, the trophy's here. So I'm trying to do this. This is the uh, diner part, Karen's kitchen. It's like a country kitchen. Like. It makes you feel like you're out in the country. I mean, you are in the country, but... Like, look at this. This is, like, unique. Like, if you have to get gas, like, you can get gas at Sheets and stuff, but, like, here, you're getting a whole different experience. Truck stops like this, but this is a unique experience. It's small, it's not that big, but this is something that if you come here off of Tom and... Tomlin Run Road, you're going to experience, you know, this unique style of unique brand of gas station. They even have a post office here. Like, I'm glad I stopped to get gas and check this place out. I'm also glad because of the corn. No, I like that corn. That corn was awesome. But I don't want to get all the people on camera, so I'm going to kind of end it here. But that is 76 gas station. And uh, it's definitely worth checking out. It's definitely unique. It's not an ordinary gas station. It's your... It's like a real unique setting. So, if you like this video, give it a like, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in the next. This is the NC Explorers, signing out.